Gentlemen, we're gonna compete all year long, man. All year long. I told you, no matter what happens, the outcome of this game, I'm proud of each and every single one of you and what you've done and the way you've battled and the way you've stayed together. Uh, obviously, the exit interviews tomorrow. Uh, get in, get out, and then go enjoy your summer. We'll talk about that later on. All right, bring it in, gentlemen. Bring it in. Bring it in. Way to compete, everybody. Way to compete. Way to compete. Way to compete. Way to compete. I would summarize this season as very fun, um, a challenging, but also a productive season. Starting off slow, you know, like five and 20, and you know, a lot of ups. Sucks. Pass 20. Jalen, the three. A lot of downs, you know, personally and as a team. You know, wish we, we'd had back, I think, the start of the season. Um, guys being hurt, you know, it's hard to find consistency like that. Obviously, early in the year, we didn't have a lot of bodies, so kind of had to play out of position in a way, playing point guard, um, you know, having a ball, running the offense. It helped me just once guys did get back and I moved back, you know, into a more of a forward role and whatnot, I think I was able to just blend those skills that I learned early in the year. You know, talk about the game of basketball being a game with runs and flow, and it's what we went through throughout the year. So their ability to be resilient in those moments uh, when it was difficult, when you get down 10, whatever the circumstances, starting out five and 20, the level of resiliency to be able to bounce back and keep fighting and keep going and not let go until the final buzzer goes off. We are a much better team today than we were in December. And, you know, I expect us to be a better team even going into next season with the awareness and understanding that we've gained for the rest of this season. And we'll build on that again next year. Uh, still being able to uh, turn the season around and have a pretty decent season and still have a chance to uh, have a chance to play for a play in coming to the end of the season. I think that, you know, I made it very competitive, but also showed us, you know, with work and consistent work, you know, you can get better and uh, really had a fun time just competing with the team, and I think we we had a great season. Personally, we didn't make the you know the play playoffs or playing game, but uh, you know to be the last team in the East um, to be eliminated with a chance to you know make it into the last three games uh, after a five and twenty start, you know I would say that's a successful season. The last like uh, fifty five games or something, we were or we were like over 500 or something like that. And so just for, you know, being a super young team, be able to not just, you know, keep saying we're young, but to actually, you know, do something like with our season and be successful in a way and have a shot up until game 79 of, you know, being in playoff contention is just, it's a, uh, it's a huge uh, uh, accomplishment, but you know, we ain't satisfied. We got a lot more work to do. And we, you know, we, we want to be in the, in the playoff run. Um, you know, but I think we all had a great time. You know, we all grew together. Uh, we all got better. Uh, you know, and we put ourselves in position to, you know, to play for something at the end of the season. So, uh, all in all, it was a great year. A lot of fun. Uh, you know, a lot of positives to take away from and, and lessons to be learned uh, to carry into next year and, um, you know, make it one of them ones. I think the way we played these last 60 games, I think if we if we take another step forward, you know, our record should show that that we're one of the best teams in our conference and you know, hopefully be in the playoffs next year. Since me getting traded here, I think it was my first time actually being able to play with guys like Markel, even Jonathan Isaac. Um, I think you know, that was really special and just to have us all out there because you know, one thing I did pick up on from there when I first got here is that they all want to win. And um, you know, I just Love being around some winners and, you know, guys who just would do anything to win. So um, I think, you know, it just kind of laid the foundation for what we can do and what we're capable of.